Thank you for everything you've done, Ensign Rini. But the truth is, I despise you. Please don't say that. That's definitely a very Gundam title. The enemy's attacking? How'd they find the whereabouts of the space? Good question. Fleet 12, join the participations to repel. Only Master has the right to instruct me. Is she an artificial new type? I heard they were originally created by Neo Zeon. Jared, there were artificial new types in your Gundam series. In. Gundam Zeta. In fact, they were introduced in your series. To be specific, well, uh, 12 Murasame. 12, 12, 12, 12 Murasame. Um, 4 Murasame, sorry. Multiple of 4. Poor Murasame was an artificial new type. No matter how bad this sport gets, resorting to such tactics is unacceptable. By the way, poor Murasame, artificial new type created not by Neo Zeon, but by the Earth Federation. Ugh, Londo Bells here. The rest is up to them. I'm Commander Bright Noah of Londo Bell. Under the Anarchic Treaty, I'm here to take custody of Neo Zeon Lieutenant, or Lieutenant Rydia Cruz. I would also like to request to meet with a woman named the name of Audrey Byrne if she is here. You Londo Bell scum! Where did you get that information? You'd be pleased if you accepted the request. Also, I, Captain Brett Noah, on behalf of Camille Bidon, if you did not accept this request, we would be happy to beat the stuffing out of you. Neo Zealand pilots aside, it's station to station, the dangerous station Federation forces with Audrey here. As expected, Helen's as high regard as she is by Neo Zeon. It's important to take her into custody before that regard can be utilized. If Londo Bell can take her in under the pretext of civilian protection during or Londo Bell can take her into take her in under the pretext of civilian protection during wartime. The problem is it's her decision. You have to be careful. They're on the move too. Ta-da! Like G Hound is stationed here. I guess talking wouldn't be an option in that case. Nothing else we can do. All units prepare for launch. Alright, I have 14 units to dispatch. So I need to make sure. Do you dispatch plea? Play two and Judah. All right. Hang up, Boss Bro. Actually, I like the Huckabee and bring back to being after all for its mobility. A couple of Spurrow bots. Amaro's much, or, uh, the Z Gundam is much more heavily uh, upgraded. Oh, the Leviathan is a beast. Um, looks like the Bang Ray is deployed by default. Uh,. Kurtz has a lot of support attacks, actually. Um, Deguza. Uh, hmm. All right, so about all three Evangelions deploying. 
Uh, let's deploy Amaro just to be safe. Attacking us while units are dispersed? That means this means this is just a stopgap measure. All units, engage the enemy. They'll be just as exhausted from the Battle of the Car. Guys never change. Violent as ever. What's going on? We're just here to help people. Justice is on our side. Something like that. Vanagar, Tobia, hit him hard. Roger. Tobia, this new armament, the Yamato Tech Kumar made it as your request is making a real difference. Thank you, Kirio. Kirio, I'll show you how quickly I can master this peacock smasher. Tobia, a little backup, please. Leave it to me, that's why I'm here. Tobia is truly in his element. Stop that black unicorn and attack the base, and then we can search for Audrey. Oh, how I envy Audrey. Vanager, Aud Vanager, Audrey, Ancient Ritty, and you, would that make for a love square? No, that's, that's not what I mean. It just saying it's been a while since anyone's thought of me in the same way that Anagar thinks of Audrey. I'm sure you'll find someone nice very soon. Even if I even if unrequited, I am the character and someone to be in love with. Okay, aim for the black unicorn er, I mean the Banshee! Murdia! We're coming to save you! Okay, so to clear the map within six turns, and within those terms, one ally pilot must use the extra action, multi-action. I think I can handle this. I think the Vang Ray's already got, um... A, uh, EXC already. Move up the uh, plays. So since the play is kind of a shared consciousness related when it comes to judo, uh, judo is certainly a good pick there. Also, just having the plays um, come to the support of um, the plays as well because they are. I don't know if the implication that um, that Tomino was going for was that they have a shared soul. Okay, so no um, terrain modifiers there, so stick with my current. Up I don't like up shitty move next because he's definitely gonna get left behind by some of the rest of the team. Right, I, well, we have a new attack. The Peacock Smasher. Let's get two fresh enemies to fire at. Let's go with you. And I've already upgraded my invisibility so much that you can't hit me. Attacking Federation Grace and helping kidnap girls escape. Sounds like exactly, exactly something a pirate outlaw would do. In other words, they're telling the perfect plan. Cut me in. Okay. So we've got the energy crossbow that fires out weapons with a beam pattern pattern. I feel like We should have an AO Whoa. Okay. One hit KO the crit. This should have a, um, 
AOE effect. Uh... Oh, only three shots of that. Okay, I wasted one of those, but I got Boss Barrow. Fortunately, I've got Boss Barrow over here. So we can resupply. And I made sure to upgrade Boss Barrow's skill ranking so that you can resupply after moving. So I got Boss Barrow move up first and do the resupply thing. All right. Okay. I should upgrade... I don't know if I upgrade your energy all the way first. I probably should upgrade your energy, though. Let's do this Sandbuster. Let's see if we can use um, mission to the dialogue here. Nope. Yeah, I should do this. Um, yeah, so no special dialogue for them. So I should probably upgrade Phobia's weapons a little bit. Yeah, you can just hear it squashed. Clear some room first, then. Um, well, okay. Just gonna make it that easy. Pretty much, and he told you to soften them all up. I feel like it should be an achievement for that. Oh, two levels from that attack. Alright, and then let's do a boss Barrow for the... Oh, he's just too, not quite close enough yet. What can we do? Do I have moving attack? Alright, so I can just hit you from here. Let's do that. And there we go, and then Boss Barrow here and resupplies.
I should probably get the uh, support attack abilities for um, Asuka and um, Shinji. Wow, uh, that's a heavy move up. But also, they really can't touch me either. They can't play as any, can't play as any lines. Play 2's Fubbly's Maneuverability. Good as I can is she's maneuverable enough that I can have her fall back and she gets in a tight spot. Okay, let's do, let's do the shotgun. Everyone here is taking some form of damage. Let's take out something larger. And let's see if Sasuke's got a line. Ah! 
外心を頼む Okay, good progress. You've acted. I'm not going to try to have the Yamato land here because it's. As a ship, it's not designed for that sort of thing. It's like, I feel like that, like landing on solid ground is a good way, and trying to move around there is a good way to take some uh, serious damage. All right, that should be everybody. Yep. Yeah, good luck with that. I can even get counter attack dialogue from it. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Them. Now Tobia can use the uh, ability as well. Uh, funnels. How much power does it? How much power does it use? Funnels. Twenty-five mm, percent. But that's a lot of juice. And I still need to upgrade like the Quebleys in terms of power and maneuverability. So. Um, Let's use the beam. Uh, let's use the um, beam saber for now. We can, that can last a bit longer. Save the funnels for someone bigger. I'm not saying you're not a threat, but you're a mug. Also, this narrative is since you're closing from melee. All right, and let's get this one. Yep, I could have a barrier and a lot of weapons. Barrier and also maxed out armor. Now pretty much everybody's in a position to use the um, second action attack. And now you're attacking the unicorn. I think I should watch this one. There we go. This one, um... Save the beam magnum for larger opponents who are more of a threat. Just they better they stick. Oh, you're that good, good by the way. Go out of the way. Has what has a Gundam ever been just for show? There we go. Now they're actually closing in. 
Alright, so. Objectives. I'm on turn three. Clear out within six turns, and one ally pilot uses extra action, multi action. Well. get both of them. and hit chance. Perfect. That's what I want it. this again. Let's do it again. So the weak slasher on uh, here. You have the most hit points for a second, and you're a sure hit. And the weak slasher does the damage that should finish you off. Yep. And that's you down. Uh, and let's actually... We change this position and use the micro missile. So we only get two guys with this. We can only hit these two guys as long as as long as blast them. Fire! this way. And hug me to do this again next turn. And I can hit Jared with the Peacock Smasher. I don't think he can hit me. I mean, you got 1% hit chance, which is... There's ones on those percentile dice, but... I can probably use the crit, the... security crit. Mm -hmm. Oh, the crit's okay. Exit like got a crit there. The Gundam from a parallel universe, that's how. New type Nanza! So send us sensor of Domini Sigina in there! Audrey, Beridia! Pettiger, lay off the attacks! Gotcha. Unicorn. No! Hanager! Where did it come from? Look out! Camille! Isn't the timing a little too good? Who cares? This is fantastic! <laughs> Not to mention, really, Camille has every reason to have a massive grudge for Jared Mesa who killed both his parents on the orders of the commander of the Titans. 
Um, Basque Ohm. Well, the then Commander of the Titans, Basque Ohm. Camille, you rogue! You're. Camille, you rogue! You're alive! Jared, you haven't changed. Don't just pick you for the old Jared. For those insurgents, I'll drop you quick. That's exactly what the old Jared would say. I've watched Good Zeta. Go. Who, me? That's right. Be quick about it. Uh, all right. The pilot. Oh, damn it. They didn't get a chance to talk to him beforehand. The destroy mode again. The reacting to Camille? Even I can tell that Camille's new abilities have increased. What exactly happened to him? The black unicorn. Is it ready for real combat? Look out. The Banshee's out to get you. I'll stop Meridia. Leave Meridia to me. That's why I'm here. The Delta Plus. Is that you, Instant Ready? And if it is, is Audrey on this base? Shut up, Banniger. Oh, fine. I'll be that way. What are you doing, Instant Ready? The soldier's duty to attack insurgents. Your ex Your Londo Bell. Huh? Do, do you even know what you're saying? Ensign, you were a member of Londo Bell. Thank you, Beecha. It's all in the past now. Ensign Riddy. Panager, wait. He's not interested in listening to anything we have to say. Fight if you don't want to die. Are you serious, Ensign Riddy? Panager, if it wasn't for you, she wouldn't have... What is the key to ending the quagmire of the war? Okay. All right. So there's that. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any f future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.